welcome back to my channel or indeed welcome if you are new to my channel. Uh, today I'm coming on to do a makeup look for you. Um, it's actually been requested from one of my lovely subscribers, Linda. Um, so it was basically, there was a smoky eye that I had on um, in my Pat McGrath bronzer review. Um, so yeah, she liked um, the eyeshadow look that I had on. So yeah, I said I would recreate it for her. So before I get started, um, I have applied my base products already. So I have the Dior uh, Forever Skin Glow foundation on again. Love that foundation. I also have the Charlotte Tilbury Colour Corrector in shade 1 on. Um, I have a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush Flawless Powder. And I think that's it at the moment. So yeah, I'm going to get on to showing you the smoky eye that I created the other day. It was a very simple um, look to achieve the other day that I had on. And it was actually the uh, Charlotte Tilbury uh, duo in, we have smoky pillow talk and pillow talk in our colour chameleons. So yeah, it's just these two products that I used. So I'm just gonna recreate that look. Okay, so you have to bear with this look because it, it might look a little bit funny um, as I'm applying it, but it'll all come together at the end, so don't worry about that. Okay, so I just literally rub my concealer in a little bit. Yeah, I just literally placed this in the socket um, and then sort of brought it out onto the side, to the outer corner and just placed it down so it does look a little bit funny and then I just got my Charlotte Tilbury um, blender brush and then just blended blend that in So yeah, just blended that in and I'm just going to blend it a little bit more. Yeah, so I basically just blended it in like that. Um, it still looks a little bit funny, but don't worry, it'll all come, come together soon. Okay, so I'm just going to do the other eye. Okay, so I'll just put about that much on. You can always apply a bit more when you're finished if it's not um, if it's not as dark as you wanted it. So I'm just going to blend that in as well. So just blend that in. Okay, so that's the smokiness of the look. A bit of concealer so I can just uh, clean up the edge there. Um, and I have my Hollywood complexion brush. And as you can see by doing that, it sort of gives you uh, an instant sort of eye lift by doing that which looks quite nice. I'll just do the other side. Don't want too much of this, so. A little bit on there. And then just uh, blend that up again. Okay, 
that's the smokiness of the look and I've just cleaned up the edges there and then all I did next was I got the Pillow Talk Colour Comedian comes in the, the duo set um, if you look on charlottetilbury.com they have this as a duo so it's quite a good price as well you get so you get the two shades um, I think it's 28 pounds for both um, and this but this smoky pillow talk it only comes in the set so if you wanted this one you have to buy it within the set and then you get the pillow talk as I say this is my favorite as you can see it's tiny now compared to this so I'm just going to apply that onto my lid show you what I've done with that I'll just literally place that onto the lid and same on the other side That was the smoky eye that I created just with these two products. So I'm now going to apply my mascara. I'm going to use the Legendary Lashes Volume 2 by Charlotte Tilbury and I'll be right back. So that's the mascara applied. So that's what that looks like. Um, so now I'm going to move on to my uh, complexion products. So I'm going to, I'm going to use the Film Star Bronze and Glow. Uh, for my bronze and highlight today. Um, Linda did actually want me to use the Charlotte Tilbury All-in-One Face Palette, but I don't actually have that palette anymore. So I know that this, this and this is in that palette, so I'm going to use these and then recreate the look by using um, a different sort of peachy blush and then finish off with a peachy lip. Okay, so I'm going to use the Film Star Bonds and Glow. I haven't actually used this for a while, so it's nice to be reusing this product. It is really nice, it's really pretty. Apply it to the other side. Okay, so that's the Film Star Bonds and Glow. So that's what that looks like. Um, I used the, so I didn't say, I used the Charlotte Tilbury um, bronzer and blush brush to apply that. Right, we'll come back to that in a minute because I'm going to use the highlight shade from there as well. Um, so the blush that I'm going to use today um, is actually a Laura Geller blush. Um, and it's in the shade uh, Poppy Peach. So it just comes with a little sponge, you just turn it up and then the product comes out onto the sponge. So I'm just going to apply that onto my face and I'm just going to blend it in with my Clinique brush. these blushes they're quite sort of like they're a serum blush yeah it says they're a serum blush um so they are actually okay to uh stamp on and then blend i don't seem to have any marks left
Okay, so that's what that looks like. I'll just do the other side. I do put quite a bit on, but you don't, you can just go in as uh, heavy or light as you like. I love blush. Not too heavy. It's uh, really pretty, this blush. Yep, so that's that applied. And then I just put what's left on my forehead. There's not actually a lot on the brush. But I just do that to sort of evens out the colour. Okay. So that's that done. Um, just one more thing, the um, sponge on these you can actually remove and wash them and you do get a spare um, sponge with each blush. So yeah, it's really nice uh, blush there. This was from QVC. Okay, so um, yeah, so now we'll do some highlighter. I'm going to use the highlighter from the Bronze and Glow palette. So I'm just going to take the Charlotte Tilbury Powder and Sculpt brush, which I like to use for my highlighter, and I'm just going to load up my brush and apply that to the high points of my cheeks. Ooh, forgot how pretty that is. I love this highlighter. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? Okay, and then I'm going to apply it to the other side. Okay, so that's that applied. It's quite pretty. Lastly, I'm going to move on to my lips. I'm going to use the Pillow Talk Lip Liner. Uh, this was a full size. But again, it's one of my favourite products. So I've gone through quite a lot of that. So I'm just going to apply a bit of lip liner. And then just fill in, just fill in the lips with that shade as well. Okay. Yeah, so that's the Pillow Talk Lip Sheet from Charlotte Tilbury. And then the lipstick that I'm going to use today, I'm going to use a Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. And this is called uh, Famously pink so it it's like a coral color it's like a sort of peachy corally color so yeah i'm going to use that today I'll show you what that looks like what that looks like and that's the finished look so I'm just going to apply some Charlotte Tilbury airbrush setting spray and then that should be me finished just let that dry off a little bit yep, so that's the finished look yeah, so that's my finished look. So thank you to Linda for requesting uh, me to recreate the eye look and obviously and the other uh, products that I used as well. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video today. If you haven't already, I hope you consider subscribing to my channel and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Okay, thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Thank you. Bye.